All right, yeah. Let's see. You say you recording? <laughs> <laughs> now we back. Cause no, cause yeah. I started recording this shit. Y'all put pressure on me. We back. We back, baby. Yo, we back together, yo. In the same room, no Zoom. Where we broke up? Team, team. Bro, yeah, but you know, we <laughs> you know, my man, my man, Mister John, and then you know the Zoom, and then, then you know. Oh yeah, yeah. It's been a minute since we've been all linked up. We 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 back, 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 back. We real like you corners. Serve Geechee fight? Oh no, nah, like a couple, a couple, like that's what, like last year. You talking about battle? Yeah. Oh, you said it. fight. Yeah, yeah, battle. My fault. <laughs> Listen, we back. Sup? Welcome back to the Never Famous Podcast. Me, we got the boys in the building. What's up? We here. We live. Let's get it. I just want to let y'all know, y'all, I'm a man of my word. My boy, Jerdy won the $50. After this podcast, I'm a cash at you, bro. That shit sound like you picked it. <laughs> my boy, yeah, that's my man. My whole life, Mr. <laughs> sound like you picked him, bro. I don't know if you one of us do it. Bro, he, he said he going to pay him after the podcast. That nigga burnt. Smell that shit in there. Nah, nah, bro, I'm going to keep it a bean. I knew most of the people in that circle. I'm fucking with you, bro. Yeah. <laughs> Nah, but the John that was scaring me, that was my girl. She she did it too. And I'm like, nah. You know. <laughs> she ain't write her name when that chase ain't done. <laughs> she did. She did. <laughs> Damn. I should have wrote done. I ain't even know everybody get parts. Nah, nah, nah. I ain't want to look like it's, I'm scheming. Because then if that, she'd probably be like, yo, keep the $50. I'm like, <laughs> true. <laughs> I ain't want to do that, though. I told her, I'm like, nah, nah. It's going to look like we scheming. It was scammers. She's like, nah, nigga. You better pay me than pay somebody else. <laughs> I'm like, she right. Listen, we. We got uh we got a we got a guest we got a guest uh about to about to pull up in a little bit but until they get here we just gonna start potting and shit. True. And uh, fuck it, let's let's get it going. Let's get it. Let's going. get it. Yo, Ryan, you wanted to say something, though, Ryan? Did I want to say something? Yeah, let me let me pull it up though so we can fact check it real quick. Right? Fact check it. Say no more. I got a question for you. Yeah, I've never met a whore. How, like like how though like from one through ten, bro. Like a whole, like a whole whole. Like 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 what? Like like what though, bro? You hey, mean? Put the clip. Put, put me. Put niggas on, yo. Put niggas on. All right, bro. <laughs> I ain't never ever ever heard some shit like this. She be like, <laughs> <laughs> how, how she how she be, bro? She, she be like, yo, listen, listen. This recording is crazy. <laughs> I don't give a fuck how big, little, or small that joint is. I'm grabbing. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, that shit is the fucking big. Yo, bro. <laughs> I heard that jump off. <laughs> Wait, but we want to get a, the, the context of that story. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so I said, I said. Yeah, play, yeah, play that. Just play one more time, though. Before, hold, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Okay. I don't give a fuck how big, little, or small that joint is. I'm grabbing. <laughs> Yo, yeah, man, this is wild. Ah, he was talking about an ass saying, Look, nah, 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 nah. I sent him the PlayStation 5 compared to the PS4, and that joint was big as shit. I'm like, Yo, this joint big as shit. And he said that joint, I was cracking the fuck up, bro. I was literally Yo, crying. But running that message back, that shit had me fucking rolling, bro. bro I played that shit like three times because nobody laughed. I'm like, Yo, why nobody laughing? That joint funny as shit. At a point that joint now, it had to. I'm like, Yo, y'all, y'all peep what my man said. <laughs> Yo, but did y'all peep uh, Oregon? Oregon on some shit. That's the new KNA. Yo, that's what I was thinking. I was like, yo, everybody from KNA going to transfer to Oregon. They going to be chilling. KNA about to be fucking lovely. I ain't going to lie. They out of pocket for that one, though. I don't get, I don't get what they want to do with the whole heroin and those hardcore drugs. I mean, it's cool. Motherfucker want to eat some shrooms, smoke some weed. That's cool. But it's, it's legal for use, not for sale. Nah, but like they, they, they make they're gonna it, make it recreational though, like the marijuana. For, if it's for personal use, you good. But like, let's say you got a lot, like on some traffic and shit, like a big amount, it's not separate or whatever. Like, oh, you of course, still getting trouble for that. Yeah, but that's for anything. Yeah, that's what that's for anything though. <laughs> you, mean, you can't have too much of nothing. You're gonna look suspect, like damn. But what, what they <laughs> they gonna give you like a dosage so you could be cool and not check? <laughs> I don't know, bro. They're yeah. not selling it though. They're not ser- selling the heroin. Yeah, I think they just if they catch you, they are gonna just let you rock type shit. Uh, you imagine they had like a, a heroin store? I'm, there's only one kind in there. Like, <laughs> That's crazy. yeah, this what we got. You buying? Yeah, I'm buying. I'm buying. What's the heroin of the week? The what? The heroin of the week. <laughs> but I, I heard some shit like, oh, like at the same time, instead of you going to jail for shit, if like you fucked up, like. It should be more accessible for you to go to uh, rehab. And shit. Yeah, I so think that's what's. what's that's I think that's yeah, that's the that's the go to that they're about to go to with that. 
I think it's a positive jump, but I want to see how how that's gonna go. But for real, for a junkies, they not even bad people. They just thieves. <clears throat> <laughs> Cause <laughs> heard this nigga. You know what I mean though? Cause they want to get their next fix. You ever got shit stolen from you? What you mean? From a like, fiend? Ever, and no, anything. Period. Like in life, you ever got anything stolen from you? That like, you know it was stolen from you? Yeah, and I was like, right. fuck, fuck up. How you gonna say they good people? I'll be mad as shit. What are you talking about? Wait, nah, you, I'm you older now. Me. I'm older now, but like, yo, boy stole my Pokemon game, bro. I was about to beat him the fuck up. <laughs> you know, when you had a family function in your crib and there's like mad people in your crib? Yeah. All the little kids in my room, we all in there chilling. He playing my shit. I'm like, I bet he dip. He live in Jersey. He dip. Never I'm, saw him again. No, I did see him again, though. That's the crazy thing. He, he like, he my uncle's stepson. So when I put up to his crib, bro, I seen that shit. Pocket that drone right back and took one of his drones. <laughs> Damn, so you got your shit back and came up one? Fuck yeah. Ready as shit. Doing some shit. Double up, nigga. <laughs> That's funny. All right, so look, uh, look, let's get into more got, serious shit, though. We got a... Uh, right, no, no, you had that drone. I got the drone for that. Oh, no, I was just going to say, I see a uh, Chappelle show coming to Netflix. Oh, that joint on there already, bro. Yeah, it's already on, yeah, it's on yeah. there already. Oh, yeah. I'm about to tune in. I ain't know. What y'all know about that, man? I done seen a few episodes. You don't know actually. about Tyrone Biggums. You don't know. Actually, Larry? <laughs> but you could probably put that joint up there just sitting on that. Just move the, move, like, pull the still piece down a little bit. All right. Fuck it. Yeah, but that joint hot. I ain't going to lie. Netflix got a lot of shit going on right now. Yeah, they should be I seen right. boys in the they hood. Their I, prices up too, I, oh yeah, eighteen, I think. God mm-hmm. damn, they going up a dollar from thir- I think it was from thirteen to fourteen, fifteen, and then from sixteen to eighteen. <laughs> I'm gonna keep it a bean, bro. Paying eighteen, bro, still worth it. Yeah, it's, it's, niggas gonna pay for it regardless. Yeah, for that's money, essentials. Yeah. That's one of the essentials. Yeah, you right? got If you don't got Netflix, it's like what the fuck. Oh, I got Netflix. I just don't pay for that shit. I'm not paying for that shit. Well, that's what I'm saying though. But you gotta have Netflix. You don't pay for your job. No, my sister pay Hell for that shit. Nah. You, you don't pay for your job, right? No, I'm the only nigga that pay. Fucking dickhead. <laughs> Corey, he don't even want that. <laughs> Corey, <laughs> like shit. Y'all pay for none of y'all Jones. Y'all got every. Bro, I got, I got, I got oh, Prime Video. I got Hulu. I got fucking Netflix. Uh, anime shit. I don't pay for none of that shit. Just need to log in. Nah. <laughs> now you know what I hate though, because when y'all like, you know how y- y'all got y'all own account though. Yeah. yeah. All right. Cause when y'all got when y'all got people and shit, y'all don't make y'all account, but then y'all click join, then y'all so try to watch the show. You pay for shit. Seen? You pay for shit, and they use your account, bro. Nah, nah, nah. I got my own account. I was about to say, damn, you got they fucking you. But over. if like if I was to ask A right now for his password, you gonna give it to me? Yeah, <laughs> bro, it's five people in my account, bro. <laughs> it's gonna be one day you gonna try to get on, and it's gonna like it's not gonna let you, and you gonna change your password. That nah, that happened already. But it be, it be my dad, my dad and Dr. And shit, he be using that shit. Oh, where? Yeah. Let me see. Uh, yo, y'all seen y'all seen when uh y'all seen uh, over the weekend uh Jay Chris got into he got he started a fight and ended up getting jumped. I ain't know he started. He that. started just, a fight and got fucking jumped. They they yeah, I, the yeah. comments yeah. actually kept killing you. Know? How how you six seven getting beat the fuck up? <laughs> but you he getting I, dropped I, again. I couldn't. I, really I didn't see even know he fought the first time. Like, I couldn't. You can't really see it. Good, good. Or you know, maybe I didn't watch it enough. Nah, bro. I don't know if you watched that part where he came back and he got snuffed. Yeah, no, I ain't even seen that jump. Fight. Like, he got stuff from like right here. Yeah, no, no, nah, nah, bro. It was like this. Like, I guess they was jumping him. He got away. But then I guess they was jumping his mans and he went to go ride. But then he was like open for a little bit. Like, he was just standing still. Somebody can't. Crack this <laughs> shit out of him. Damn. Somebody was getting with the Philly joint, like, pussy. <laughs> <laughs> Dickhead. But Hit him hard and, and shit. He's not pussy, though. Cause nah, a, lot, nah, nah. a lot of people would have been pussy. We gotta be honest. Yeah. I mean, a lot of things. But of wait, so he got jumped people, by a lot of niggas. I got yeah, some video. Bro, it was a, it was a, it was a crowd. That's yeah, it was, a, it was a few people. But you can't even barely like see. That, you can't even barely see what's going on. It's like I seen like six videos, bro. You could barely see like you kind of just see him like when he like falling a little bit or he like that. But you don't never really like you can't see clear, clear like of everything that's going on. And I seen right. like six different videos. None of them is good enough because there's so many people. Like so it's all just like a crowd type shit. Yeah, it was a and bad then, John. Uh, Rod Wave John, we they fell on the stage and shit. That John was funny. <laughs> yeah. him, Yo, bro, like, bro was, he, he didn't come on stage with like a hundred people. Bro, bro that like, shit was slow mo when he went down. Nah, right? that, that's that's, that's why that's he's short as shit. Bro, that's that's some fat nigga shit though, bro. <laughs> Cause look, everybody fell down, but the stage had actually fell down. Yo, but where fat. he was at, bro, if you were skinny like y'all too, would have probably been like, all right, I'm up. <laughs> this nigga said. 
I'm like, bro. yo. <laughs> bro, he went down like this. That shit like timber. <laughs> I'm like, what the fuck? Then he gonna he gonna stay on IG talking about y'all niggas uh, weird or some some shit like that because I'm getting paid. I'm like, nigga, we we know you getting paid. He talking yeah. shit on the niggas that made the stage. Yeah, shit, but like. you fell. <laughs> you didn't even cut him a check. Our, our shit cool. We so we here. You didn't even cut him a check for falling. Nah, he probably just got paid for that joint though. Oh yeah, because he ain't perform, right? Yeah. <laughs> I don't know if he ended up performing or not. I got a. Uh, if he did, he a champ. <laughs> keep, keeping it music and shit. Uh, Rest in peace to the baby brother that committed suicide. Oh, yeah, yeah I've seen that. that. Yeah. That's crazy. Himself and shit. So, uh, rest in peace on him. Check up on, on the people in y'all lives that got mental health issues. Oh, not even. Just people like yeah. anybody people you want to talk to, man, for real. But you know you know what, man? Like, it's easy It's easy for me to say, like, say, yo, check up on people with mental health issues. Yeah. But a lot of times, bro, you don't. Damn, bro, you going to break that shit? The hard shit about. Um, about saying like how I just said, oh, checking on the people, or like or I just said, oh, like even if I like I think y'all cool, but, like I, even if I don't think I got shit, or if y'all yeah. do, like, but let's say y'all do, right? Hypothetically, how like it's easy for me to say, but I don't know how to help y'all. The point is what I've been trying to get off. No, I mean, because the the thing is like my, I don't mean to cut you off. I'm sorry. Yeah, no, you if you like if you tell us right, because we we all in the chat and you write in the chat, yo, like going through something or whatever, it's like oh, yo, I'm here for you, but that like. If you ask me for something, I'm gonna do it. If I tell you I'm here for, I'm gonna do it. You know, mm-hmm. If I can, if it's right. not possible, I'm gonna do it. But then at the same time, how like how can I make y'all feel better? I mean, you know I think mean? a like, lot about it is being able to talk to somebody too, especially from uh, m- mental health. Like, I mean, I know one of my things. You know, you always ask like, "Yo, what's up, bro? How you?" You know what I'm saying? And you know, nigga, first response is good or chilling. You know what I'm saying some cool shit. But you know, I always ask further than that. I'm always like, "How you mental?" Like, because at the end of the day, like. Niggas really be going through shit. We all go through shit, you feel me? But nobody really talk about it because we don't take the time out to really, you know, ask somebody or we might have enough on our own plate, to be honest, you feel me? So that interjects with the 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 positivity that you want, might want to bring to them for real, for real, you feel me? So there's a lot of different ways that you go about it. But I feel like even listening, that's a big help, you feel me? Yeah. <laughs> listen, yo, we got listen, we got we got a special guest in the fucking building. As y'all can see, as y'all can see. Yeah, man. I mean, what's yo. up, man? We got it's the OBH fish. What up? Yo, what up? How you feeling, man? What's up, man? I'm just happy get get a man, get a little man. bit closer to, to the microphone, bro. You want this drum, bro? No, I'm cool. I'm just happy to be here, man. I appreciate for you for coming, bro. Yeah, man. If I if I wish I could remember the drum. Tell him something, man. Tell him something. Like, we can ho- find you. I'm saying. Hold on, hold on. You about to close? What, what job you got? I heard. Nah, I, I don't know what drop I gave you. I gotta, I gotta fix my fucking drops. Uh, <laughs> Come on, man. I, I always have a fix it, but I never do. And we got, we got a, a, a rapper right here, like shit different. This bars, this Philly shit right here. What up? It's not, it's not no regular fucking. I mean that bullshit that 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 what what uh what a fucking rhyme like that yeah bullshit. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's, it's not, it's not that. <laughs> Uh, nah, but shout out Uzi, though. I'll fuck with you, though. <laughs> Talking that bullshit. Uzi, man. <laughs> I'll be in there. I, I like Uzi. Y'all don't like Uzi? Nah, I'll fuck, I'm with, I'm fuck, I'm I'm fuck, fuck with, with Uzi. Him. I think Uzi hot. <laughs> nah, his fir- I ain't fuck with his first tape, though. Kind of uh, weird for me. But the second joint, that's a classic right there. On the, on the quiet, he got, like, bars a little bit. Like, yeah. that's yeah, not yeah, bars, I, but, like, he say Uzi, shit, you be like, oh, shit. Like, yeah. if you listen be to going him. Yeah, Matter of fact, I'm going to ask you, bro. Cause I feel like Meek Meek in a different category already. Mm-hmm. But who 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 would you say? I seen the post. It was uh, Tierra Wack, P and B Rock. They said to go to Philly John, Yeah. And who else? It, it, it was, was Lil Uzi, Uzi and who else? And Kurt and Corey. Who you say would be the goat right now? Out of them. Uzi by far. Uzi know. Uzi bigger than Meek. Who oh, say him again? It was uh, Tierra Wack. Uh huh. Corey. Yeah. P and B Rock. And Uzi. Yeah. Tierra Wack. I would say I would be the goat out of them. <laughs> <laughs> Talk your shit, bro. <laughs> I think that would be me. Speck it. Nah, but speaking on that, because I had I definitely had a question right now. Uh, somebody from Philly collabing. Right. Who you think be a good fit for you? For me? If you could pick uh any anybody in Philly right now. Right now. Yeah, somebody you haven't you haven't worked with yet though. I don't know. I would like to work with. I would like to work with a couple people in Philly, man. Young, old. 
Probably uh I don't know, I'm leaving niggas right now. I probably like I like I like Leaf Wood. Yeah, no, nah, I fuck fuck with him. He nice. It's a it's a lot of it's a lot of like people that's that's on the, like in Philly right now that's on the cusp of like uh breaking through, but I think it's, it's hard for Philly. Like what you what you think it is like it's so it's so hard for Philly rap like Philly artists to break through. Cause even listen like Tara Wack coming up right now, but it's I feel like she's been coming up for a minute. Or like he you know, should die down type quick. Of course shit, I feel like he never really reached like the level. Then Uzi just blew that shit out the park. Yeah. So it's just like how what you think is the like what it like what it is with Philly? Why do they hate Philly so much, man? Do it seem like everybody hating on Philly, man? Philly got the best rappers, man. Everybody will tell you that. And ain't nobody that uh that a dispute that, man. But I, I think too a lot of a lot of shit is like we won't hold each other down. Like a lot of a lot like of pick each other up. Yeah, yeah. Bro, yeah. I don't even know what it is. It ain't even like like Philly Philly don't support Philly for real. Like certain people, yeah, we obviously but but it, we don't really see that shit unless you reach a certain tit and everybody thing, but I feel like we don't really support each other like that. You know what it might be too? The mainstream. I don't know. It ain't mainstream, you feel me? Like I feel like Philly got bars and they be talking about some street shit, feel me? It it's a lot going on in Philly though. Yeah, like, you know what I'm saying? Like it ain't even that people don't support people in Philly. It's a lot going on in Philly right now. You know what I'm saying? Like it's to the point right now, like like if you see somebody post something on Instagram, right? I know for me, I might not even like it. I might be game banging. Like I don't know what this post mean. Like why? This, like what's right. going on? Like right, you know right, what I'm saying? Right. It might be a nice picture with a sneaky cat. I, <laughs> I don't know, man. Like you know, so you know what I'm saying? Like you know, you hear you hear a rapper. He might say some heavy bars. You don't know who he talking about though. Like you know what I'm saying? Like so it's like you don't really want to be a lot of shots thrown. Don't even know yeah. what's going on. I feel like when I when I listen because uh, they put me on and shit. Like I, I'm not like real in tune with Philly music like that. So when they put me on, I heard you shit. I'm telling them before, I'm like, yo, I don't like, I don't know who to who to compare you to. Who to be like, yo, like like your influence type shit. Right. Like so, who who you think is a, is an influence for you? Like, for I don't, me? I can't. I feel like it, your sound it, it sound like you. Mm -hmm. I mean, or like or like like OBH, like y'all sound. Yeah, I don't. Yeah, I don't. Y'all yeah. yeah, don't sound like nobody else. Yeah. I don't know. I don't know who I would. I don't know. It ain't really nobody you can compare me to. Like, I don't know. So, who, not compare you to, but who would you say put that stepping stone that made you want to rap type shit? You feel yeah, me? That made you want to rap. That made you like, yo, he got some bars. I bet you, I mean, I put up some bars too. Like, that made me want to rap. Like, influential type. Yeah. If I ever rapped, I'd be like, I should probably be like, nah, just some shit. The I'm person, not good, but you know. <laughs> Fuck it. Let me say, like that's, that's, if, that's, if we talk in industry and we talking about, uh, you know, rap. It don't even got to be industry, bro. It could be somebody, yeah, yeah. somebody, whatever. Oh, yeah, well, if we talking about what made me want to rap, like, who made me want to rap, it would have to be my man, Dane. And, man. My man Dame Dollar, we we uh we was we was young boys and shit. You know what I mean, we chill on my block. You know I mean, he start rapping, so you know I don't know how to rap at this time. Like you know what I mean. So I, all I can do is bust. Like you know, I was I was good at that. You know what I'm saying? Like, I would make people cry or, or we end up fighting. Like you know what I'm saying? Like what's your what's your age difference? You you and your man? How, like he older or younger than you? Dame, he probably got me by like a year. He probably got me by like a year or two. Yeah, so I mean he he made me wanna rap. Well how he made me wanna rap was he was corny as shit. <laughs> right? <laughs> no, I'm a I'm a, no, this just I'm keeping it a thing. Like he was corny as shit, right? Then he beat me. So you know I had a big ass, like, you know what I'm saying? I was mad as shit. I said, nah, I, I don't like that. Like, you know what I'm saying? I went in the crib, I tried to I tried to write something. Y'all can hear me? Yeah, we good. Yeah, good. But yeah, I went in the crib. I tried to write something, man. I couldn't do it. I mean, it took me like three weeks to write this rap, man. <laughs> I wrote this rap, my first rap. I go out there and I killed the shit out of you with that. First, I played it around like how I always do, like, you know, funny, busting. <laughs> 
then I got serious on the third round. You know, it was three rounds. Oh, y'all was battle rapping. Yeah, y'all was battle rapping. Yeah, we was battling, and I and I beat him. And I mean, and the, and the rap I spit, it, it was so hot. Like niggas was like, "Yo, man, you just gotta do this shit." I wasn't on it back then. Like I just was playing around. So your I people just only wrote that for home. That was for home special, like. <laughs> <laughs> so how, how old were yeah. you? How old were you at that time? At that time, I probably was like ballpark. You know what I mean? That's probably a while ago. I probably was like fifteen, man. Yeah, I, rem- I remember. I remember vividly. So I <laughs> first rap. I remember that shit. That shit was called "We Built This City." <laughs> yeah, I mean, I, I killed you so bad on that job, man. It was just y'all too. It was like an actual battle drum. No, it was an actual battle, man. This how this how it happened, right? <laughs> I told <laughs> I told my man Don I had something for him, and he just was like, "Man, whatever, man. Like, let's get off that." <laughs> he tried to like play me, <laughs> so I spit the joint. He like, "No, you got something for him." He like, "No, you gotta give him that." Like, we gonna set that shit up. So I never knew when the setup was gonna be. So one day we just chilling and shit. He was like, no, nah, come on, let's go to my crib. We go to his crib. We go upstairs in his room. It's like, I don't know what time it is, man. We young boys. It might be like 12, 1 o'clock, 12, 1 o'clock at night, man. He trying to catch you unprepared. Yeah. <laughs> he trying to catch you in the room, like, room, right? He was trying to- He take the light bulb out his, out his jaw. <laughs> <laughs> he take the light bulb out his room, right? He put in a red light. <laughs> <laughs> I know, yo, this nigga the crazy. Room put in a red light bulb, right? He meant business. <laughs> the room red now. He turned the cam on. He started recording this, and that shit was on. And that that drum was alright. That drum was alright. That's funny. Like like he that, he then had a whole like a URL battle scene, like a whole drum, like the it was just like the drum, like the drums now in Caffeine. Yeah, yeah. The jump man, die. What up, die? You watch, you watch better rap? I watch it sometimes. I like, I don't really like like since I started like get back on my shit rapping. Like I haven't really been listening to anything rap, any type of music. Why? Why? Because it influenced you to do something similar or something like that. Yeah, like subconsciously, like you would do that. Like I know for me, it's like that. Cause I be hearing uh, Wayne. Wayne said that too. Like he don't listen to nobody. Cause he feel like he might he might sound similar or say something that somebody already said. Yeah, and I I hate to be compared to people, man. Like I feel like you can't compare me to nobody, like especially if they writing that that shit. Like you know what I'm saying? I'm going into the studio. I'm freestyling. I'm I might got and it wasn't always like that. It just started getting like this. But I might just got like a little. I might got four bars if that. But I got the beat. Like, you know what I'm saying? I go in the studio and I just do whatever, whatever come. You know what I mean, so, what, so when you come out like that, you don't, you don't, uh, you don't write. You just, just punch in type shit. Like you just go. Yeah, it's a whole lot of punches with me. Or, yeah. yeah, I just had an incident, man. Listen, I want to talk about this too, man. Since I'm on here, I want to talk about this. Like, I feel like. Engineers, y'all gotta be careful with the product, man. <laughs> well, they be fucking up. Your Listen, I'm freestyling, right? I just had a, I just had an incident, right? And it ain't, it ain't really about nothing. Like it was an accident, you know what I mean? But uh, I, I just had an incident where I, I just had a session and I, uh, I came up with a song. It was alright, but. I don't write that shit down, you know what I'm saying? And what happened was, I guess, uh, I don't know, I guess a wrong button got hit or maybe a button didn't get hit, I don't know, but it got deleted. And you know what I'm saying? It was like, it was it was a big thing, but really for whom, not for me, I'm telling him like, it ain't really nothing. Like, you know what I'm saying? It's my man and it happens, like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. But like engineers y'all just gotta be more careful with the product like that's for me because i'm not i don't know nothing i don't i'm not like you know what i'm saying i so happened to write the 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 first verse in the hook because i did it over but i don't i don't write like you know what i'm saying so and because i only had the first verse in the hook like i just threw the whole joint away like 
Yeah. That's I like that's basically like right your, your your book right there, like just your playbacks, like your play that John back. Let me see what I said, and you go off for that. I, that shit going to me. That <laughs> I, I rather <laughs> just move on, man. Like I just I'll be mad. I be grabbing. I really be grabbing words out the air, man. Like I got I got something coming up. I'm gonna show people how I be doing that shit, like. So you say you started like you battling you battle your homie and all that shit when you were like 15. So you like, that's when you kind of was like, damn, like you got, that's when you want to do the rapping shit? Like around that age? Or like at, at what age you really was like, yo, I'm gonna I'm really do this rapping shit. Like I'm gonna try to go as far as I can. Mm-hmm. I don't know, I just started feeling like that, honestly. Like I never like, with me, I never, uh, I never really seen myself as a rapper. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, my man rap, he hot. You know, A hot, Leak hot. Every, like, everybody got that shit sold up, I feel like. You know what I'm saying? So I never felt like I, I like, I needed to really, like, be on the front line of the shit. But I always liked rapping. And I always, you know, I always rap. I always had my little bars. But I never thought they was really serious. I always thought I was hot, but I never thought the bars like I had was really serious. Like when I listen to A or I listen to Lee, like they they tell me I'm hot, but uh it's like I never really uh so, I never really believed in myself like to the point where I thought I could sell music. You know what I'm saying? So you so at that at that time when you so you were like Cause you're not like you saying you're not really believing in yourself. So what what changed? What made you be as like, oh, far as gotta, selling music? Change. Like I don't I don't even mean to say believe in myself when I say it like that. I mean to say as far I never I never saw me like you know selling music like you know what I mean making money off that shit being a rapper and that's what I mean by that like. But uh, I always thought I was hot. I like I always been hot. So what what made you want to like turn it up now then? Uh. Just being with Leek, man. Leek got me on my shit, man. Like, I ain't gonna lie. Like A A locked up right now. Free A. Fucking uh Leek just been holding it down, man. I just been, you know, going to city to city, state to state with him. Yeah, it's like why not? Like, you know what I'm saying? So you, you feel like you gotta you turn me up. I feel like you turn me up. You feel like you got you got to turn it up now that now that A not here that uh, ARM not here for the people that that's not uh familiar with who you are. Uh, you feel like you feel like you gotta you gotta turn it up. Put more? the backpack on. Yeah, yeah, put the backpack. No, you gotta. I mean, you, feel you gotta you gotta put more pressure on. You gotta take it more serious. Or is it or is it something? That it's like that. It's, I feel like it's like that now. Like it wasn't it wasn't always like that, but it's like that now. And Leak man, he behind me hundred percent. I mean. OBH behind me 100 percent So we going But I feel like maybe I said I'm saying me as as somebody who don't rap, but don't you feel like like your brother's putting like that battery in your back and like hearing that from Ab and Low and Leak and they telling yo you like you you gotta take this shit serious cause you nice with it. I don't I don't know them personally obviously, but I feel like if, like they wanna just tell you like oh yeah, that like they don't seem like the type of boys that'll just be like, Oh yeah, cause you cause you around, just do it, you know what I mean? When that shit, you don't feel like that shit like I ain't gonna motivation. hold you One of my last conversations with Low, And I, I got locked up before Lil got locked up So I ain't, I ain't You know what I mean I wasn't around for that But uh, One of my last conversations with Low, He told me like Yo we gonna like, I promise you like We gonna be somewhere Different this, this shit Like you know what I'm saying mm. yeah, Like I believe in you Like you have this shit Like I want you to really do this shit <laughs> Lo just told me like he, how he believed in me, man. How he wanted me to do this shit. You know what I'm saying? He told me we we're gonna be somewhere different. And I, I believed in him, like you know what I mean? I, I started believing in myself. That so basically put like the fire, fire. Yeah, I'm saying you know? put that battery in your back, yeah. make you want to really turn it up. Well, really put the well, really put the fire in my back, the battery in my back. I'm telling you, man. Leak, man. You can't just be sitting around <laughs> fire, man, and not get burned. Like you know what I'm saying? Like, For sure. That shit. He doing right now on another level. So back to the all right. So like the OBH, like how did you? How, well, how did they find you? And how did that come about? Man, I always been around. Like 
I met Ed probably when I was like, I would say 23. So then from, from 23 to, how long, I've been for like a year, two, two years. I got, I had, damn, I got that shit ran down. Like two years. As far as the community you growing up, like North Philly and shit, you know what I'm saying? So growing up, seeing what you've seen, been through what you've been through, you feel me? Do you feel like that motivated you to rap about what you rap about? Or as far as like, you mean with the motivation that come from what you've seen? Yeah, I'm one of them rappers, like, I gotta like, I can't talk about it if it ain't real. Like, you know what yeah. I'm saying? Like, I don't, like. It gotta be authentic. Basically, you a product in your environment. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. I, I seen a I seen an old uh low interview right, and the yeah. end, like it's old but it just it just came out recently, on the John he talked and he said like because you you say you've been around with them and shit like that and I feel all of all of y'all yeah yeah of a certain cloth of of y'all don't rap shit like what he's saying like y'all don't rap shit that y'all ain't live shit mm-hmm. that y'all ain't do y'all of that cloth. <clears throat> so he and, and in the interview he say like 80 90 percent of the other uh, industry niggas is it's not really like what they what they what I, he said they pussy i don't want to quote that oh i'm gonna quote <laughs> it he said they pussy you don't gotta necessarily say that but they not really necessarily who they who they portray Most to be niggas is pussies though <laughs> <laughs> i'm gonna say that though but uh you know most of niggas pussy <laughs> so what you what you got uh you got any any uh any any shit out right now or some new shit coming up that you wanna you wanna mention huh? Any any new songs yeah, I got, or projects? Uh, I got I got uh I got a joint coming out called Basquiat. I'm working on uh a, a little mystic I got coming out called Who Am I and then uh you know I'm just working with a lot of artists. I got some shit with some Atlanta artists. I got some shit with, uh, you know, a couple Philly artists, a couple, uh, couple, couple good people. You got you got a date for we working. You got a date for the for the mixtape? No, I ain't got no date for the mixtape. Actually, uh, I gotta sit down. I still gotta sit down with Mars, man. You know, I run everything through Mars, man. As far as the rap shit, you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. As far as like, I'm really trying to make him be my manager. He don't want to manage me. But I yeah, mean, we gonna figure something out. Tell them where they can tune in too. Uh, IG, all you, all that. Oh yeah, Guy Fisher, man. OBH, man. OBH, Guy Fisher, man. Hit me up. What's so, up right now? Right now, you don't got a manager. A uh, manager, no. Nah, at the moment. You, you feel like that should that should help you? Like, like if you get one, or you think for the moment? Like- yeah, I need a manager, man. I need I need a manager, man. So whoever out there, man. That's honor. That's of that's of it. Hit me up, man. If I like your resume, man. <laughs> uh, you ain't say nobody that that really inspired. Oh, you say your homie that inspired you to rap. But who who you listen to right now uh, on the regular tape shit? Like, what's your a quick top five? Not all time, just right now. Or I mean, like some shit, some people that you fucking with. Nah, right matter of fact, bro, that top five, that sh- that should get. Be yeah. jumping. Yeah, I want to hear the top five. Fuck it. A top, <laughs> what like a top five and uh, f- like five Philly. top rappers that you. Fuck I don't with. even got to be from that. Philly, bro. Like you, mean, can, yeah. you can mention a couple Philly um, people. Yeah. I don't even got to be from Philly. I think Dutch got a, a project about to come out. <laughs> you like a legend in Philly. Who? Uh, who? Mm. I don't know. Like you don't got big hoes, nah, nobody like that. Snoop, yeah. a lot of people like that. I ain't got none of them niggas in my top five. I ain't got <laughs> Everybody in my top five, I know. I, I'm, I'm not. I'm not. I'm sorry. Like I'm not one of the. I'm not like your average rap. I'm not going to give y'all them joints. Like you know what I'm saying. The main my top five is the people I. I like know. I got love for. Like you know what I'm saying. They really hot. <laughs> no, they were like really good too. Like, you know what I'm saying? But uh, as far as an industry and shit, top. Um, I like I like rappers like Kiss, Nas, motherfucking uh, Wheezy. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Lil Wayne. Classics. You know I like, I like, uh, 
I don't know. I'm I'm like I'm just borderline that era. Like I like you know, you know I like Fifty Cent, motherfucking uh, mm-hmm. yeah. Shout out Griselda, Benny the Butcher, and all them. They 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 doing anything right now. Yeah, yeah they hot right now. Yeah, yeah they shit on fire and shit. Fucking, uh, I'm trying to think, but you know it's crazy. I'm gonna give it to y'all like this, man. Best in rap, right? Who y'all top five? Who your top five best rappers? Nah, it's all different for us, bro. Like, yeah, 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 yeah. different, different. <laughs> So it's all different drums, right? Yeah. But why though? Because that's that's like what y'all listen to type shit. Feel me? That's that's. It's hard to say who the best rapper was. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. That's all the Everybody opinion. gonna have different opinions. Yeah. yeah. Nas. If Big was a lot, yeah. he might he might have declined. What what if he what if, what if y'all asked him who his best rappers was? You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Well, he put he not gonna have himself. They probably gonna put Mace. He gonna put he gonna put. But he might he might have declined though. Might, we don't we don't because we heard what with two big albums. We don't know. He not he not. Nas. Yeah, because we that's we ain't know. Yeah. Beat. We don't, right. we don't know what we got. We would have got from that. He in my top five, but I, I, I mean, you got to keep it a buck. That's the way that I see it. Man, there's somebody out there that might think LL Cool J the best rapper of all time. <laughs> That's right, bro. Ever <laughs> yeah, if, you, if, you, if you say any Meek Mill, I'm gonna push you. You know what I'm saying? Like, <laughs> no, nah, like you got people who think like that. Like, so you know when you when you talking about something. But what I can say, they was they was great rappers, bro. Not even great rappers, like they was great for the culture of rap. Like you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. They actually put they they put they they put their footprint on it like so deep that right now there's still people gonna say that they the best rappers. Like you know what I'm saying? Yeah, and show appreciation that, that it yeah, ever was facts. that it ever was in hip hop. Like you know what I'm saying? And when they and when people start talking like that and they come up with their arguments, I'm like, damn, them niggas really was like all that, like you know what I'm saying. And, and I would never take nothing away from it, and I don't want to disrespect the culture, you know what I'm saying. But right. to me, if you ask me, who who my favorite rappers are and shit, I'm gonna say. Probably three of them I know, like you know what I'm saying, and that's that's uh that's just keeping it real, right? You know it's crazy about that though, bro. Cause uh, in Philly, everybody say that Philly don't support Philly, but since you got here, bro, you've been supporting all your people. Yeah, all that's right. facts, though. I, I love my folks, man. I ain't gonna hold you like. I don't know. People got like a bad. It's like a bad picture painted with OBs. Like rappers be scared to like hit me up and all that. Like I didn't. I didn't had a conversation with somebody. He's like yo, man, boy, like really fuck with your music, man. He want to do something <laughs> with you and shit, but he just don't you know fuck with your folks. Yeah. So you know I'm gonna tell like you scary know, movies type shit. So first thing I'm on is like I, all right, fuck home. <sighs> But uh, <laughs> it's like damn, that's that's what it is though. Like yeah, you know what I'm saying, yeah, and that's, that's the shit I'm dealing with. Like you know, that's what I'm saying? fact. Yeah, I bro, I, I was watching interviews and shit. I'm looking at shit. I'm like yo, motherfuckers really scared to link y'all. Like <laughs> like yo, yeah, we gonna link da, 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 t- two or three times. Yo, we gonna link, we gonna link. Never link y'all. That's crazy. But. Niggas, niggas know, man. Like, you know what I mean? <laughs> like, we just been holding it down for a long time, man. You think you think the uh, coronavirus fuck, fuck shit up for you? So, like, now you think you, the, like... If, 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 man, I had the coronavirus about three, four times, man. No, no, but I'm saying, like, the whole, like, pandemic. You think it ain't slow shit up for you? Like, shows... Yeah, like, that, that, shit, like, fuck, that, yeah shit. that shit fucked the bag up, yeah. like, all the way. Right. Like, it, you can't even, like, go nowhere, like... Shit, shit, even shit now, like it's open, but it's closed. <laughs> it's like, why, why am I going all the way over Yo, there? Like, I gotta, you telling me, come to Atlanta, right? You can do a show in Atlanta. 
It might cause me more just being out there chilling and shit like than what I'm gonna meet going out there like you know what I'm saying like. So it's and there's like, not a lot of people like still going to events like that because of right. they scared. Atlanta don't give a fuck, bro. I was, I was I in Atlanta a couple, a couple months ago, bro. I was out, bro. And club it's like who packed. really trying? Out there. Club packed, It's like bro, some people packed. like still on the tip. Like who really trying to be in a packed ass environment? Yeah. Like, right? nah, like, dip. I was there for like thirty minutes. I don't mm-hmm. know. Find out. <laughs> fuck that. But that's why with the protest, that's why it was kind of weird too. Like people protesting. But it's like we still in the corona, like yeah, shit, shit a different. It's a different world right now. <laughs> a lot of shit going on in the city, man. A lot of shit going on in the city with these protests and the raids and all the other bullshit. I just feel like I don't know, shit going left. The body count in Philly. What you? Yeah, what you? What you think we could change in this? Like something that out the city. October was the deadliest month for all time, murder wise, in, in the city of Philadelphia. They yeah. killed, I think, it was like sixty people. That shit. Sixty people in the month of October. Numbers is going up. Yeah, what you what you think we could we could or like the city should do though? Know I mean, maybe try to help it out. Try to calm it down a little bit. I seen like in Camden and shit. They got like a, a couple years ago. They used to have cops on every corner, like certain shit. Like you know what I mean, just to calm shit down. I don't think bit. that's what I yeah. I don't <laughs> know the answer, man. I don't. I don't know. I don't know the answer. I don't think it's what the, like. When you, if you talking about the city as far as like you know the political side, it ain't nothing really they can do. But on our on our aspect, it's like man, like what y'all doing? Like, yeah, I like getting money, man. Like you know what I'm saying? It's there, a lot of people got different priorities, of, like, bro. It's a lot of shit going on right now. Like you know what I'm saying? Listen, not to end this off on that because that's really a real negative note. But yo, Philly, do better, man. Do yeah, fucking we got, better. We gotta do Listen, we got OBH in the building. Fish, like I said, you got some shit coming real soon. Stay tuned in with him. That's a five out right now on all platforms, man. Make sure y'all go tune in on that too, man. I got a couple joints out right now. You got some shit, definitely. Got tune in, tune in. I'm fucking with it for sure. Um, it's another famous podcast. Thank you, uh, everybody for tuning into the raffle. Uh, we posting the raffle, showing love, following, subscribing on all streaming platforms. Thank you.